In this video we're going to be showing you how to take away the plinth of certain units. So for instance if you just wanted legs underneath this this island unit and you and you wanted legs underneath the this draw unit and this draw unit you can take away the the plinth just for those those units and the island units. So what the first thing that you you would do is you would go into your plan view and highlight the units that you're wanting to to put legs under. So we go select FD4 and there it is selected. Now what I do now is I, I hold down my shift button, I right click on the unit the next unit that I'm wanting to get rid of the plinth of. I go to the FD2 plus 1 and I continue on until I highlight all the, the units that I need. So I hold down shift again and I click on on the units by the, the island unit and the last one in the island unit there. So there's all the all the units that are that I want to get rid of the plinth of and put under under legs. So what I do is I go to change. Sorry, I go to call and auto features, and I click on auto features. Okay, under auto features, the first thing that we we're going to do is, is click on this little button that says exclude selection. So you click on that. And if I'm just working on the plinth, I can untick the, the worktops, the pelmets, and the, the cornices. And then it will just take away the, the plinth from those units I've highlighted and add plinth to the rest of it. So let me press OK. And that will start working out the, the plinth for this room. OK, our plinth have been taken away from these units. And now what we're going to do is we're going to add legs in, into this. So we click on the on the cupboards icon and we type in F four leg. Now we can choose a six leg or a, a eight eight legs or or ten legs. But for now for these the small units I'm just gonna say a four leg. So I click on my straight line tool, I click at the back of that unit, click once, drag it across, click again, and that should have added in that leg. Straight line again for this one. End it there. And there's that one there. Now I'm going to go for a six leg one for, for here. And I'm, I'm going to make the depth of it 600. And let's start from this side. Click on our straight line tool. Click from this side. And end it over there. Okay. Now what we're going to do is go and have a look at it in, in perspective view. So we right click on our design and go to perspective view. And here we can see the, the legs that have been added to the these units, the island unit as well, as well as the, the draw units. And also there's no there's no plinth there, so that's what happens when you when you t exclude the, the plinth on those certain units. And this ends a small video on how to get rid of plinths on certain units and also on how to to add uh, legs under the units. Thanks very much.